years now. A lot goes into being a successful gymnast. Speed, grace, body control, sometimes apparel. Tim Van Voren goes beyond the game. The WIAA held its 50th annual state gymnastics meet in early March, just before sports competitions began to get shut down. History merged with the present even more than expected. Addie Galoon is a junior from Whitefish Bay High School who's been one of the top performers in Wisconsin since she was a freshman. Her routines looked as sharp as ever at state, but her leotards looked a little different. No one wore any vintage leotards except for me. So everyone was like, why are you wearing such old leotards? And I was like, for fun, because I wasn't about to tell them what it was for. It was actually for luck and more. In 1976, the Blue Dukes coach, Mary Lanuski, was a ninth grader at Webster School in Milwaukee and won a state title in bars in her blue leotard. In 1999, Julie Steffen, who would become a teacher in the Whitefish Bay school system, was the vault and all-around state champ in her black leotard. Galoon reached back into the archives, winning the bars wearing blue and the vault wearing black. Both of them were like very different feels than what it was to wear my original competition Leo, with the one I've been wearing my entire high school career. It was cool to get a new feel, like it didn't feel different. I felt more confident in them in a way. Whitefish Bay is a perennial state contender in Division II. And there's Addie rehabbing using her crutches. But faced injuries and stiff competition this season. And Linuski's father passed away during sectionals weekend, making the state weekend a very emotional time. To see Addie who I've raised in the gym since she was little and to see that when she put on my leotard, it brought me to tears, to be honest. It was such a very special moment to see, you know, that it sat in the closet for 45 years. I was so proud, very proud. Here we go. Good luck, Addie. Addie's two event wins helped her claim the state all around time. I started crying, I'm not gonna lie. Like my coach has a video of me like hugging all my teammates when they announced my name. And I went up there and I started crying because it was something that was really special to me and I like wanted it, but I, I wasn't gonna be upset if it didn't happen. The sport of gymnastics has come an awful long way in the last 50 years and a 2020 champion helped bring some of that progress right to the podium. Tim Van Voren, Fox 6 Sports. Addie has already undergone off-season ankle surgery and hopes to be able to go for more state titles as a senior. Her coach says the lucky leotards are going to be hung in Whitefish Bay's gymnastics gym until another Blue Duke may need some luck at a future state meet. Well, while sports...